And good. <clears throat> Whew, had to start that over. And good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and whatever time zone you're in. Welcome back to Assassin's Creed 3. So wait, Assassin's Creed 3. My bad. Assassin's Creed Syndicate walkthrough. Man, we have gone past. We have a lot of Assassin's Creed game. Isn't there Assassin's Creed Mirage coming out? I think next year or. It's not this year. A next year, but I think it's just got a revealed and announced. I don't think there's a release date for it yet. And then there's other Assassin's Creed games. <sighs> Man, Assassin's Creed, it's going to be around forever, isn't it? Well, anyway, because it's International Day, I figure I do pretty much London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. Sorry. Okay, go inside now. Miss Thorne will have your guts for garters. Let's have a butcher's downstairs then. I want to see that artifact. Not if you value your life. <coughs> hey, leave them rats alone. They've as much right to be here as you. Mind your own post. I'll feed them to me cat. Poor little rats. Got it. Downstairs for a taste. Would he tell us?
Thompson's out there. Let's find out. Look, will you just run now? <sighs> There you are. The entrance to Bruce's lab. Can't it wait till the morning? No, it can't. So do as you're bloody told. And by the way, it's sir to you. The blokes are knackered, sir. Someone's gonna get hurt if you push too hard. Honest to God. And <gasps> they'll just uh... Just to protect. 
Eden. Increase the electricity. But it'll become unstable, sir. You heard what Miss Thorne said. We need results now. Time to lay down your head, Sir David Brewster. But I have so much more to discover. Do not be afraid. I'm not. God will protect me. I will continue your experiment. You will not stop, Staric. Miss Thorne has already found another piece of Eden, more powerful than the last. I will take that one, too. We fight to gain what we cannot take with us. It's in our nature. Was that explosion? What explosion? 
EV. Piece of Eden detonated and took the lab with it. The magic lump of hyperbolic metal. I'm shocked. Simply because you have never valued the pieces does not All mean... went according to plan, hmm? <clears throat> there was a slight complication. How slight? The lab exploded. Jacob. You derailed a train. Oh, he did. Did he? Well, the train derailed and I happened to be on it. I killed my target. Brewster is also no more. Then all in all, a successful mission in spite of you two. What about London? What about it? We're wasting our time out here. You know as well as I do that London has been the domain of the Templars for the last hundred years. They are far too strong yet. Patience. But the Templars have found a new piece of Eden. Sir David is dead. They do not know how to use it. The Council shall guide us. Sound advice that your father would have seconded. I shall see you back in Crawley. Patience, Evie. Oh, the gentle sound of opportunity passing us by. So what's stopping us? London is waiting to be liberated. Forget Crawley. Father would have wanted us to listen. Oh, father! You could continue his legacy in London. Freeing future generations from a city ruled by Templars. You know, Jacob Fry, you might just be right. Then shall we? Yes. Let's. Onward to London. <laughs> Dr. Grammatica. Come on. Who is Isabel? What a lovely surprise. Our mutual friends will be here shortly to search for the artifact. Once it's located, I'll let you know. Super. Always a pleasure. Prick. It's people like you that give historians a bad name. I'm afraid I don't have time for you today, Mr. Hastings. Thank you for making my job easy. Oh, shit. It does look grim. Master Berg, Agent Acosta. Deal with them, please. Move it! Hunt them down! All they had to do was wait for you to search the data. Their little stunt has put the whole operation at risk. You need to synchronize Jacob and Evie's memories. Find something that puts us ahead of the enemy. Time is of the essence, and lives are now clearly on the line. Good luck. seen so many people all at once. <laughs> Churning seas of London. It's just the way Father described. Now, to find Henry Green and formulate a plan of attack against the Templars. Who's Mr. Green again? The assassin watching over London. 
Did you not listen the first three times? Listen to what? <laughs> Oi, watch it. Beg pardon, sir. Oi! Come back here, you filthy dipper! Jacob. little mobsman keep it well well what do we have here you're on our property all of this i'm carving you Excellent. What else does London have to offer? Now is not the time for tourism, Jacob. Now's the time to find Henry Green. I've always been the quicker climber, haven't I? Not since we were two. Race you to the highest vantage point. You're going to lose again. Not on my watch. shop located. It was marked on Father's map. Two assassins. Equal in height. One female, one male. Two decades old, and those devilish smiles. You must be the Fry Twins. And you are? Henry Green, at your service. I was sorry to learn about your father's passing. Thank you. What can you tell us about Crawford Starrick? I suppose the Council desires news. London must be freed to provide a better future for all of its citizens. Well, thank goodness the Council saw reason and sent you to aid us. Yes. Thank goodness. Unfortunately, I am the bearer of bad news. Today, Starrick sits at the helm of the most sophisticated Templar infrastructure known in the Western world. Every class, every borough, the gangs, the industries, his reach extends all across London. I've always thought of myself as a gang leader. Firm, but fair. Huh. Well, I have uniforms. And I'll unite a mix of disenfranchised outsiders under one name. That's it, Evie. We can rally them to our side. Oh, like the way that you rallied those car players at the Oakwood Tavern into the river. Oh, that was different. They beat me at whist. I can see it now. We'll call ourselves the Rooks. You're never good at chess, either. Have you got a better plan? Find the piece of Eden! Oh. Well, let me show you the lay of the land. Shall we? Climb the chimney and see all of London for yourself. Thank you. 
Look at what Starak has done to the city. Whitechapel is riddled with crime. Child labor, despite regulations. A gang known as the Blighters overruns the streets. And Templars manipulating behind the scenes. As in all the other boroughs, we need to return this city to the people who built it in the first place. We will free London from Starak. You have my word. I my looks. Miss Fry, your passion is inspiring. Come. Let us return to my shop, and I can bring you up to date on the rest. looking for me. Who's Kaylock? One of Starrick's gang leaders. Why does he want you? He's after some of my more arcane research into one of the precursor artifacts. The Peace of Eden. So tell me about these blighters. In search of an army, Starrick gathered up the nastiest of the underworld. Some of the city's gangs tried to prevent it and were slaughtered for their efforts. Now, only Whitechapel's clinkers remain opposed, but they're no match for the blighters. Well, let's shine these clinkers up then, shall we? They're just the sort we're looking for. You can't be serious. Evie, they're ready to fight and oppose the Blighters. This is my chance to step in. Look out, London. Here come the Rooks. <laughs> <laughs> 